Hello everybody, today we are going to study class at Thansiati Science. Chapter number 12, Friction. Friction is the force resisting the relative motion of solid surfaces, fluid layers and material elements sliding against each other. Question number 1, fill in the blanks. A. Friction opposes the dash between the surfaces in contact with each other. The answer is relative motion. B. Friction depends on the dash of surfaces. The answer is smoothness. C. Friction produces dash. The answer is heat. D. The sprinkling of powder on the carom board dash friction. The answer is reduces. E. Sliding friction is dash than static friction. The answer is less. Four children were asked to arrange forces due to rolling, static and sliding frictions in decreasing order. Their arrangements are given below. Choose the correct arrangement. Number 1. Rolling static sliding. Number 2. Rolling sliding static. Number 3. Static sliding rolling. Or number 4. Sliding static rolling. Yes, you are right. The answer is static sliding rolling. Question number 3. Alita runs her toy car on dry marble floor. Wet marble floor. Newspaper and towel spread on the floor. The force of friction acting on the car on different surfaces in increasing orders will be number 1. Wet marble floor, dry marble floor, newspaper, towel. Number 2. Newspaper, towel, dry marble floor, wet marble floor. Number 3. Towel, newspaper, dry marble floor, wet marble floor. Or number 4. Wet marble floor, dry marble floor, towel. Yes, you're right. The answer is wet marble floor, dry marble floor, newspaper and towel. Question number 6. Explain why sportsmen use shoes with spikes. Answer. Sportsmen use shoes with spikes to increase the friction between shoes and surface. So, the shoes with spikes do not slip while sportsmen run and play. Question number 7. Iqbal has to push a lighter box and Seema has to push a similar heavier box on the same floor. Who will have to apply a larger force and why? A heavy object produces more friction. Produces more friction as it is pressed against the opposite surface. So, Seema will have to apply a larger force. Question number 8. Explain why sliding friction is less than static friction. Sliding friction is less than static friction because a sliding object takes less time to interlock into contact points on the floor. So, it is somewhat easier, easier to move a sliding uh, uh, object already in motion as to get it started. Question number 9. Give examples to show that friction is both a friend and a foe. Examples that indicate that friction is both a friend and a foe are number 1. Friction as a friend. Number 1. It allows us to grip and catch any moving or any object. Number two, it helps us to ride. Number three, it helps us to walk comfortably on the floor. Number two, friction as a foil. Number one, it causes wears and tears in moving objects. Number two, it causes damage to the parts of machines which further require money to get them repaired. Number three, it produces hurdles in moving object freely. And number four, it reduces the speed of moving objects 
so more force is required. Question number 10. Explain why objects moving in fluids must have special shapes. Objects moving in fluids must have special shapes to overcome the fluid friction acting on them. Efforts are therefore made to minimize the friction. So, objects are given special shapes having ended points with pointed ends with little wooden middle portion that gets tapered at the back called